Hello, this video is on how to change the theme of your website. So this is the basic setup. Um, a theme is the is, how, is basically how your website looks. So you want to be able to uh, create a website that matches your audience and uh, makes it really easy for people to navigate through. That might sound a little complicated, but don't worry, it's not. In the past, you've had to have a lot of HTML experience and know how to program to make these websites look really nice. But nowadays, with WordPress, it's so easy to just plug in a pre-designed theme and just start your website. It makes it really quick and easy. So what you want to do once you've logged in is click on Appearance here on the left-hand side. And as you can see, these are the themes that are already installed. This is the default theme that comes with WordPress. Um, if you want to see what that looks like, you can come up here to the upper left hand corner and just uh, left click, I mean, I'm sorry, right click on the link for your website and open it, open in a new tab. And this is what your site looks like right now. Um, this default theme is not bad, you know, you can use it if you want, but uh, I have a theme that I really like that I've been using for my sites that's free and it allows you to customize a lot of the um, or it allows you to customize the layout of your website really easily without really knowing any programming so that's what I like about it the most so we'll come back here to manage themes and you want to click on this tab at the top install themes and in the search box here I just want you to put in ATA um, as you can see that's or here's the whole name of the um, the theme Ata Hualpa I guess is how you pronounce it but that's the theme that I like so we're gonna click here on search and that's the first one to come up so then what you want to do is you want to click on this install link here and it'll give you a quick preview of what it looks like and you can click on the install now button okay and then it says successfully installed the theme Atahu Alpa 3.49 okay so then you want to go to this activate link because you want to make that one the the active uh, theme on your website and now it says the current theme is that. So if you go back here and you refresh the screen by clicking the refresh or reload button at the top, or you can also click, uh, you can also press F5 on your keyboard. And as you can see, the entire theme changed. And this is a great place to get started. So in the next videos, I'm going to show you how to customize this a little bit more and maybe not make it perfect just yet but get it to a point where you can publish the, the website and and start giving it out and then after you can get to that point then you can start refining it some more and some more until you get a, a site that you're really happy with but for now we're just gonna stick to the basics and I'll see you in the next video